designs. Embroidery Studio is designed to look and operate like many other Windows applications. You will notice many of the icons look familiar. When you first open Embroidery Studio, a tip of the day will be displayed in the center of the screen. To close the tip, simply click the close button. After this, a welcome screen is displayed. It allows you to get right to work. From the welcome screen, you can choose several options, including importing an image for digitizing or opening an existing design. The first time you run the program, you may want to select the option that says set to work with inches or millimeters. When you click this option, it takes you into the system parameter settings. Click the drop down menu under unit system and change it from metric to English. Then click OK. Now all measurements will be displayed in inches. Embroidery Studio supports most popular embroidery formats. To open a design, simply click the Open icon. At the top of the Open Design window is a drop down menu labeled Look In. This lets you select where you have a design stored, whether on a CD, flash disk, or in a folder. From the File Type drop down, you can select the type of embroidery file you are looking for or you can select All Embroidery Files. Embroidery Studio will show a preview of any embroidery file you click on. Select the embroidery file you desire and then click OK. The design will open up on the screen. As you work on your design, you will often want to zoom in to get a better look at the design. To zoom in, click the Zoom icon on the top toolbar. Then click and drag a box around the area you want to zoom in on. To zoom back out, simply click the Zoom Out icon, or you can choose the 1 to 1 ratio, which is actual size. You can also fit the design to screen, or you can select the exact zoom factor you would like by selecting the percentage from the drop down menu. You have a couple of options when it comes to saving a design. They are Save Design and Save Design As. Save Design allows you to save the current design under its existing name and location. This should be done periodically as you are working on the design to prevent any data loss in the event of a computer failure. The first time you save a design, it will ask you what you want to name it and where you want to save it as well as the type of file format you would like to save it in. Embroidery Studio allows you to save in many types of home and commercial embroidery file formats. Most of the time you'll want to save a design you have created in the CHE format. This gives you the most flexibility when it comes to editing the shape and the settings of a file that has been created in Embroidery Studio. Embroidery machines often require a specific format, such as DST. To save a design in a different format or to change its name or location, use Save Design As under the File menu. It works exactly the same as the Save button, but allows you to save the design with a different name, location, or to convert the design to a different file type. Embroidery Studio is a feature-rich embroidery program. This CD will show you many more of the features available in the program. Enjoy your program and thank you for purchasing the